This is Shougang Park. It used to house a steel plant with a history of about a hundred years. In the old days, people came here to make steel. Last year, athletes from around the world came here to compete in the Beijing Winter Olympics. Nowadays, people come here to stroll, chill, and try out something new, like taking a driverless cab. That's what I'm doing now. Shougang Park is the testing ground of driverless cabs. So that means cabs with or without drivers run on the same road. So this is my cab's right of passage. Let's see how it does. Here I'm entering the last four digits of my cell phone number to open this door. Of course. Safety first. I will be fastening my seat belt. Okay, all set. There is a screen touchable here. It says "Start your journey." I'm gonna touch start. Okay, off we go. No sudden stop and sudden start. I can barely feel any lurch, which is good. We can see that the screen on the back of the driver's seat, no driver, so the front seat shows basic road conditions, pedestrians, and cars around. It shows that we are going at a speed of 40 kilometers an hour. It also maintains a very safe distance with the vehicle in front of it. See, I can hear the turn signal is on because it is going for a turn. Ah, oh, we're taking a U-turn. Now it's slowing for the red light in advance. And it stopped with plenty of time. So I hailed this cab from Apollo Go, an app developed by the Chinese internet firm Baidu. For 30 yuan a ride, passengers like me can buckle up in the back seat and tour around Shougang Park's iconic sites like these. Now it's slowing for a zebra crossing and some pedestrians. Well, they seem to be curious. I think they want to get in our cab. It also slowed for a garage exit because there could be cars coming out of it anytime. So far, I think my cab is driving steady and has a very considered driving style. It's really reassuring. I've heard that cars like this one are equipped with radar sensors and cameras that perceive road conditions and collect other information that could affect driving. But as for the details, I'm still in the dark. I'm hoping that experts at the office of Apollo Go here in Shougang Park can give me some answers. So we are nearing our destination. It is Apollo Park. Stopping. And off we go! This way. 然后该标准法自动驾驶分为L0到L5级别 其实已经超过了7000万公里 
五个城市。呃，我们预测在二零二五年将实现 L 四级别自动驾驶无人车的一个规模应用。Beijing has plans for Shougang Park to nurture artificial intelligence innovation beyond self-driving vehicles. It seems fitting that Shougang Park, once the site of heavy industry, will soon be playing a significant part in the next generation of industrial technology.